Okay, this is a quick video demonstration of the new Mad Light feature that comes bundled with Mad Mapper 1.3.1. Uh, it's not a tutorial, it's more of a demonstration, and I apologise for the quality of the video as I'm shooting off my phone. Um, let's get started. Over here we have the hardware side of things. So, to start with, I have my Entrek Open DMX Ethernet box, which I bought directly from Mad Mapper. Uh, next I have a DMX to U, uh, LED driver which I picked up from eBay and to power the LEDs in the driver I've got a 12 to 24 volts power supply and then finally just a, a quick array of LEDs 25 strips in all in total. Uh, now that I've built a scale model uh, and I'm happy with the results I'm gonna go ahead and build a full scale version of this. Uh, back to Mad Mapper as you can see, I've got all my fixture lists, and down here the properties for each fixture. I'm using a generic Pixel L. I've got my subnet mask at one and my universe one, and I'm starting on channel one. Over on the Entrec, I used an IP address of 192.168.1.17, and then on the Mac, I set the Ethernet port to uh, 192.168.1.16 which is just a point below. Uh, the Mad Mapper seemed to pick it up straight away. There was no real configuration with the Artnet box. It just seemed to work. If I go over now to uh, mod, uh, Modulate and I switch on, as you can see, I've got a full frame of white. And then over, you can see that all the LEDs are now lit up. If I change the video now, you can see I've got a stripe of white going across from left to right and then over on the hardware side of things you can see that the LEDs are lighting up which is representing what the video is playing. If I change the video you can see that the LEDs are working. So for a quick example I pieced together a very quick video uh, in Final Cut, loaded it into Modulate, so it's a bit of Daft Punk and a bit of visuals just to see the performance of the Mad Light. And that's Mad Light. If you have any questions, drop us a line. Thank you.